Kia ora, good afternoon. Thousands of people are marching through central Auckland this lunchtime, protesting against plans for the super city. Local iwi are angry that the government has ruled out dedicated Māori seats on the council, and many others think small communities will lose their voice in the one big council. In a moment, we'll talk to John O'Hutchison, who's with the marchers at the bottom of Queen Street. But first, Brooke Sabin has been flying over central Auckland to get an idea of the scale of the protest, and he joins us now, Brooke. Good afternoon, Sasha. We're hovering about 1,300 feet above Queen Street at the moment, and I can certainly tell you getting around by helicopter is the quickest way to do so in the central business district at the moment. Now, as you can see from these live shots, about 3,000 protesters are gathering at the base of Queen Street at the moment, and they're expected to walk along towards the town hall shortly. Now, a number of streets surrounding Queen Street are at a standstill. Indeed, Queen Street is completely shut down. Now, we've been up in the helicopter for the last half hour, and I can tell you this hikoi is causing significant delays, especially on arterial routes feeding into the main Queen Street area. Now, the Three News helicopter isn't the only chopper that's been in the sky today. The police helicopter has also been up here keeping a watchful eye over events. And, Sasha, police are again warning for commuters to stay away from the central business district because they face significant delays over the next couple of hours. Sasha. Brooke, thank you. And as we saw, marchers are currently gathering at the bottom of Queen Street to march up to the town hall. Jono Hutchison is with us, with them there and joins us now. Jono. Well, Sasha, the picture here this morning has certainly been one of a noisy and spirited protest. We're standing here near the Britomart train station at the bottom of uh, Queen Street at the intersection of uh, Queen and Albert Street. Now, the uh, various groups coming from their respective starting places have converged here and when they arrived they greeted one another with a karanga and a haka. There's also been uh, singing and chanting breaking out throughout the day uh, and uh, a large number of coloured uh, umbrellas as well as banners uh, and flags too. Sasha. OK, Jono, what do the protesters actually want? Well, the main issue at play here is the... Uh, the government's preference not to include allocated Māori seats in the Auckland Super City Council. But there are a number of other people here today who have various other issues with the Super City Plan, uh, either as a whole or the way it's being implemented at the moment. Uh, but Prime Minister John Key has said that he doesn't believe the hikoi is the right way to go about things. He says this should be taken through the parliamentary process and he doesn't believe uh, that it will have much of an effect. However, the organisers say that they are confident that the hikoi will uh, help get their voices heard and they believe the government has room to move and this will help uh, with uh, getting across their point of view. Sasha. Jono, thank you.